This is the Life and Reflection 3x3 Accordion Mini Book Tutorial. I am going to show you how easy it is to make holiday gifts using our new accordion mini book templates. Today I will be using the Evergreen template featuring photography by Ashley Glasgow. Let's start working with the templates. I have the front and the back panel open. You're going to notice on the back panel there are two white spaces. Those spaces are going to become fabric covered when you print your book and I'm going to show you how to print your book as well. The next thing you're going to notice is there are a lot of gray blocks here. Those are photo layers ready to create clipping mask. I'm going to show you just how to do that. Let's start by selecting our move tool you can see that there and now we're going to select the window cover photo in the layers palette if you do not see a layers palette simply go to window and check mark layers okay so now that that's selected you're going to open up a photo of your choice feel free to pause the video if you need to to retrieve that photo we're going to hold down the left key on the mouse and drag our photo over that layer. And now we're going to right click the photo itself and choose create clipping mask. And that's going to pop that photo right in there. From here you can simply position it just to where you'd like to have it cropped. So that is how all of the gray squares work. The next thing you're going to see are text layers. With this template, fonts are included, so don't worry if you don't have these fonts because you will now. And if you decide that you uh, want to change something like the date, for instance, maybe you're using this at a different year than 2014, you're going to select that text layer, come back over here to your toolbar, select the text tool, place it somewhere inside of the 2014 and now you can change that just like that and go back to the move tool to set it there we go okay so once you have those complete this is what they're going to look like Okay, so now we have all of our photos in place and our text created. Now, uh, the next thing that we're going to do is you want to make sure that you save this as a JPEG. And by doing that, you're simply going to go to File, Save As, type uh, whatever it is you need to type there, and make sure you choose the format JPEG. And click uh, Save somewhere so that you can find it when we get to the printer. Now I'm going to show you how easy and affordable it is to print your mini book. We're at ProDigitalPhotos.com. We're going to go to the top toolbar, select Create Accordion Books. We're going to scroll down to the bottom, select Create One Now. That's going to open up a new window. We're going to scroll to the bottom again, and we're going to select the one at the very bottom right corner. This you'll note that this one says requires two images which is exactly what we saved and you see this price here that is the price isn't that awesome we're going to click on the photo it's going to open up the software so we can add our album right here choose add photos and then you want to go ahead and find those photos that we just created. What I do a lot of times when I'm going to upload photos to Pro Digital is I go ahead and just save them on my desktop because then it's just so much faster for me to get to those. You're going to click OK once you've selected your album templates. They're going to load and this, these load really fast. You don't believe that. Look at that. They're already loaded. Okay. And now you're going to notice down here it says front. So we want to make sure that we select the front template. and you're just going to drag it right over there okay and then um, and 
and see these lines here it's not actually going to crop your album at those lines you're actually going to get the full album so you want to just le leave the zoom alone and all that stuff just leave it as it's set and then you're going to click on the back one and we're going to drag the back panel over all right it looks good okay so now we're going to choose next step now you're ready to select your order quantity um, your papers that are included uh, you certainly don't need to select rounded quarters or UV coating envelopes none of that this is already set for you um, if you have any kind of special instructions you're welcome to add one there you're gonna click next step again and now it's simply just kind of previewing what you have and see that again five dollars so you're gonna click add to cart and from there I'm sure you know what to do all right you guys have an awesome day um, and I hope these mini books spread a lot of joy to your family and friends